But now that we're in, what's it called? Tur Turfield? Now that we're in Turfield, let's uh, go up and find um, Sonia. So the Puppo ran this way. Okay, let's see what he's got. What's happening over here? Renowned since the days of yore for the stunning and historical geoglyph ge ge upon our hill. Okay. Do I have to battle you? No, I take, took a photo of Geoglyph, but it just doesn't compare to seeing itself. Still looking at the photos enough to bring back rushing emotions. Oh no, they are up there. A bow wow. Okay, let's keep on trucking. Here we go. Thanks, Yampa. Bow a wow wow. Had you come because I wanted to hear what you thought. Okay, look at this weird thing up on the hill. So, the geoglyph, what do you think of it? Uh, Dynamax? Seems likely, it certainly looks like a gigantic Pokemon. I suppose people 3,000 years ago could have imagined this, but it looks too similar to Dynamax. It can't just be a coincidence. Long time ago, a great black storm covered the Galgar region. Giant Pokemon ran rampant. What was that black storm they called the Darkest Day? What connections does it have to Dynamax? Guess I'm a lucky lady who'll be looking into that. Friends sure gives me a lot to do. Thanks for your thoughts on the matter. As thanks, I'll give you a lead card. Sick. Milo's lead card, you put it in your album. Milo, a grass type gym leader. Things will go well for you if you use a fire, flying, or bug type moves. Take these two, it'd be pretty bad if Pokemon weren't in fighting form. Put the revives in your medicine pocket. Go on then, get yourself to Turfield Stadium and battle yourself, silly. No problem. Well, I guess if we're going straight in, let's uh, put our, our reboot first and foremost. Let's get our fire type on. This is pretty cool though. Sup dog. Okay. Ooh, we got this little thing back here. Three X attacks. And then let us head to the gym. From this way. Let's get to battling. Take a look at this, the Grass Gym Badge. I've got one in one try. I reckon I'm just the greatest when it comes to wrangling Wooloo. Had plenty of practice at it after all. But I'm sure you can win this one too. After all, you are my rival. Yeah, you know it, you know it, bro. Let's get, I reckon we can probably get through this in about 10 minutes. <laughs> ah, yeah, thanks for rolling by. Have a chat with me, mate, the bull guy. Son of a friendship, let me give me a wonderful Pokeball. Ooh, a friend ball. Strange Pokemon to make in the wild. Pokemon call is more friendly towards you immediately. Okay, cool. Ooh, very nice, very nice. Is that kid a gym challenger too? Yeah. Oh. Oh, this is very cool. Hitting grand though, maybe not for now. Maybe not now. Um, but let's go to the shop. Let's quickly stock up on a couple things. Um, potions, we only got three. Let's get another six of those. Three, four, okay, yep. And just confirming that everyone's looking fresh and ready to fight. Yep. Let us jump in. Welcome to the Challenger Alignment to help you through your registration. First things first, how about a quick refresher about the gym challenge? Your goal as a gym challenger is to complete each gym mission, defeat every gym leader, and gather eight gym badges. Got it. So, would you like to attempt a gym mission? Sure. If you'd like to attempt a gym mission, please change into your uniform. Alright, no problem. Let's get our skivvies on. Then let the gym mission begin. Give it your best shot. Let's go. Reboot all the way there. Ooh. 
first gym. Let's get pumped. Hey. Look at this. The mission given by Turfield's Pokemon Gym is this to chase the unruly Wooloo. Okay, to the blockade we made out of Bale's straw up there. Oh, by the way, you can call me Dan. I serve as a reservoir and also my job to report the results of the battle to League Huge Q. Now, let the gym mission begin. Okay, no problem. We can all go over there. Yep. Groovy. Let's keep on trucking. Keep on going on this way. There we go. All 20. Some breezy. Let's fight you. Welcome, Gin Challenger. Sorry, but I have to send you packing. It's my job. Well, you know what? The challenge my gym trainer, Samuel. Samuel, dude, your hair is something. Is most definitely something. Oh, our rap boot's gonna get. He's gonna have fun. He's level 21, everyone's level 16, he's a fire type. This is gonna be an absolute blast. Let's use quick attack. And one down. Is this is the strongest Pokemon? Do you have another one? Uh, yeah, that was the only one. First dream turned it down. As expected, Jin Challenger and the Pokemon are perfect in sync with each other. You know what? You know what? You're my homie. Push him up the side here. Then we'll have to go back and Fight that trainer up on the over on the right there. On one side. What's this guy back here? Hello, I wonder if your Pokemon want to use their moves with all the strength. Feel great. Yep. Very much so, Mark. Thank you. Funnily enough, you look like the other guy. Steve or whatever his face was. Um so, we're gonna have to kind of just wait. Break here like a toothpick? I think so. We're getting absolutely rolled. Come on, switch out your Pokemon. No, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. I think I'm pretty good. Um, let's just use Flame Charge again. Your Dunyan Rings. From okay, next thing, reboot level 2, 22. That's what we want. See you later, Mark. We on to the next ones. Which way should we go? Let's go... Let's go left. Here we go. Yep, it's on me. Gym leader lies just ahead of you, but that doesn't matter. It doesn't mean you'll be reaching him. I think it does. I don't think I've even taken 20 damage so far this whole gym. Go on, Rabbit, you can do it. Yeah, well, you know what? Let's just use a bit of Ember. It's a bit of... Yep. See you later. Ciao. Or if a ditch. Ah, you know what? I'll keep with Reboot. I'll keep him. 
Keep them on. Let's use an ember. Oh. Oh, this is a bit embarrassing. It wasn't one hit. Oh, that hurts a little bit. Hurts, hurts the dignity. Just a smidge. It's alright. You know what? Reboot, I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of everything you've done so far. <laughs> Thanks, Leah. Next is Gym Leader, right? What a strong challenger. Oh, well, you know. Hopefully, Milo, Milo Thatch will be a, a worthy challenger for me. ways. These gosh darn rulers, they've been an absolute treat this whole game. Kind, kind of. Okay, let's go up and let's start to chon Milo Batch himself. Gym mission cleared. Mm -hmm. Should we quickly heal? Let's quickly heal. You know what? Let's go with full beans. And now for the main event. Number two, stepping up to the plate. Oh, look at his belt. I like how he's so buff. Like, it's huge. And he's got like a little... Oh, he's got the face of a ditto. Milo, my gym's the first one people face, so we get a lot of challenges. That's why I tried to keep the gym mission challenging, but I didn't stop you from completing a Drew proper job. Proper job. Sure seems like you understand Pokemon real well. This is going to be a doozy of battle. I have to Dynamax my Pokemon if I want to win. Yeah, sure, I mean, if you're all a boot. If you want to, but. I'll we'll probably just use what it's super, what you call it. The challenge by Jim Leader Milo. Yeah, look at him. He don't even have no nose. Go on, Reboot, you know you can do it. Very much so. Max Phenomenon. The Gala region Pokemon become far larger than usual in certain places. This transformation is called Dynamaxing. Press the Dynamax button when your Dynamax band lights up to Dynamax your Pokemon. Pokemon can only be Dynamax for three turns. During that time, Dynamax Pokemon can use extremely powerful moves over Max Moves. These Max Moves not only deal tremendous damage, they can also trigger special effects. The exact effect changes depending on the type of move used. Choose case lead when to Dynamax your Pokemon and smash your way to victory. Now sure, let's start Max. Um, and let's use a uh, Max Play. And um, let's see how this goes. Mimi Big Boy, right? Mimi Big Boy. Yep, 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 yep. Just for some reason. I mean, why not? <laughs> Just got fucking demolished. Absolutely wrecked. On like this little fucking oh. Um, I'll keep using it. Woohoo, we're not going to be done in that easy, we're tough as weeds. Okay. No problem. This is another max flip. Come on then, it's done max time, you're about to be uprooted. You sure? Like... I think he's had his legs, he's pretty cute. I love you, little bit of rock or something. Oh, okay. That was a noise. I'm still gonna smash him. 
Super effective. Explode it. Hey, Copper Squire. Wants to move taunts. Wants to learn taunt, sorry. Um. Uh, target a taunt and a razor only to use. Only attack moves three times now. Nah. Looking good. Yeah, choose a reboot. They're much appreciated in this world. Defeated Jim Leader Marley. Yeah, gets. Get Rex Scrub. The power of grass has wilted. What an incredible gym challenger. 3.2k! Ha <laughs> ha! Fist bump or something. That must have been a fulfilling Pokemon battle for you. As proof that you defeated a gym leader for the gym challenger, allow me to present you with your very own grass patch. Ah. Uh, shake them hands. Ooh. That's a bit cool. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 25. You need to obtain all 8 gym badges in order to complete the gym challenge, and the only way to gather the badges is to defeat every gym leader. Yep, we've heard that like five times already. Challenger Drew, most sincere congratulations on defeating gym leader Milo. Please accept this team to commemorate your victory. Magically. Mm, thank you. Uses scatters curious leaves that chase the target. The attack never misses. Yeah. You can also have Milo's uniform to go with it as a replica, of course. Thank you. Who's this? Ah, oh, it's Mr. Milam. Some advice for you, Drew. The gym challenge is set as a set order you'll need to follow. That means your next stop should be in Hullberry to meet Nessa. Hullberry is just beyond Route 5. Well, since you got the grass badge, you can also head to the wild area. It's a bit tricky to catch Pokemon that are higher level than the Pokemon on your team, but they make powerful allies if you succeed. No problem. Well, look at that. That was a bit of a rock and roll, a little bit of a rock and roll session right there. Turfield. Now, for sure, I'm going to run out and old mate's going to be like, oh, what's happening? What's happening here? Uh, yeah, little flower thing. Ooh, Pokemon Ball over here on the side. Cheeky. Oh, yes, Max Revive. Um, but. If we head to. Let's see, if we quickly check the map. To head to Route 5, is that. We're heading this way. So let us quickly go into the Pokemon Center. Um, let's heal up. Let's get everyone top notch. Thank you. Brit, look at you, you loose unit. Absolute loose unit. Um, do, let me quickly check something. What item, What other items do we have in our bag? Pokemon ball, Pokemon doll. Some berries. Uh, we still got these little XP things. Get your scooter to give it a slowpoke. We go. Everyone's pretty even now. It's what we like. Stardust. Escape broke. Groovy. Maybe let's head out. And let's start trooping onto route number five. Let's see, is there much over here? Um, okay, I guess I can't go down there until we have a Pokemon that knows Surf or something. And now we're on route five. To head off to Holberry. Um, but with this, I think we're going to wrap it up for today and for this part. Um, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. It's been an absolute blast. Um, and we will see you next time.